Many Texans now have another option when it comes to solar energy. Tesla launched its first electric retail plan in the world right here in the Lone Star State this week. It's also part of a pilot program with the Public Utility Commission of Texas and ERCOT. KXN's Tahir Rahman breaks down how it works, who can opt in, and who can't. A new way to harness the power of the sun for your home and sell the extra energy to the state's grid, making it stronger. This could be a very competitive solution. UT researcher David Tuttle explains. Each one would be small, but combined together, they make a meaningful amount of electricity and you could export it as a virtual power plant. ERCOT says no virtual power plant exists in Texas that sells on the wholesale market. This new pilot program with the PUC allows Tesla and other companies to try to do that. And this pilot task force, I'm really proud to report in conjunction with ERCOT, is solving that in Texas for the first time. You need one of these, a Tesla Powerwall. The company says their app will allow you to sell your extra energy in ERCOT's market when it's in high demand and valuable, lowering your own bills. This initiative is about Tesla's customers, and it is also about the retail energy offer that Tesla can bring to this market. Right now, Tesla solar equipment is being installed in Austin homes, like this one behind me. But right now, not everyone can tap into the company's retail program. Well, I think it's pro to have another retailer because that's adding to the number that compete in the competitive areas. That's the key. You have to live in a competitive area. That means if your provider is municipal, like Austin Energy, or a co-op, like Blue Bonnet, you can't take advantage. Your provider would have to partner with Tesla. ERCOT says that's about 25% of the state. The rest is fair game. And it'll be very interesting to see over time how it all works, how much does it save customers, what are the complexities, what are the lessons learned about it. Thahua Rahman, KXAN News. And right now, ERCOT and the PUC say companies like Tesla are gathering customers for this pilot program, but it won't launch until next year, and there will be a cap on the amount of energy bought and sold so that the agencies can analyze the costs and benefits of it and resolve any issues before expanding the program. Austin Energy customers, y'all can still go solar as well. You can earn a monthly value of solar credits. The current rate for those credits is just under a dime for every kilowatt hour. However, if you are leasing your system, you are not available for those credits. And remember, a third-party company can't build a solar setup on your property if you are an Austin Energy customer. And that's because Austin Energy has the exclusive rights to sell electricity in its service area.